Okay guys, so this um, video is about a um, semi foyer makeover that we're about to do. I found an idea on Pinterest um, to put some um, trim boxes on either side of our foyer. We do have a two-story foyer and it's very plain. We painted the walls gray, but again, it's very plain. So I found this idea on Pinterest. Um, I'm gonna have a contractor come do it tomorrow morning. Um, so I wanted to film the before, just bare walls. And then um, he's gonna put white um, trim molding boxes and then at home, Depot, which is where we purchased all that stuff from, we got all of the materials we needed. And then at Hobby Lobby, we actually found the same identical iron pieces that were in the uh, Instagram picture. So I'll insert a picture of that. And so I'm really excited to get this done. We do have, we had the contractor come over last week to kind of measure for everything to let us know how much trim to get and how many wall pieces in the picture. So this is, I'll insert a picture of this below, but this is kind of how it's gonna look on the wall. The, the blue painter's tape will be, of course, the white trim molding boxes and each um, iron piece will have its own trim molding box around it and then a huge one around all three. In the Instagram picture, there were only two um, trim, trim boxes and then one large one around it. So two iron pieces on each wall, but our we discovered that our foyer walls are larger than in the picture, so we decided three would be best. So I had to go back and purchase two more iron wall decor, decor pieces from Hobby Lobby because we only had four. And then all of this is the trim that we brought from Home Depot. And then here's some other items here that we needed. The white paint, um, some putty, spackle, paintbrush, painter's tape, and then the actual caulking. So I'll come back tomorrow morning once he gets here and starts and I'll try to film the process for you. So this is like the first vlog style video that I'll have going. Let me know in the comments below if you like this type of thing. I'm trying to do um, kind of a house makeover series. So this is the, um, I guess the first one that I'm, I'm posting um, of us actually in the process doing it. So you saw the before, I'll link the after um, pictures and I also vlog when it's, once it's finished. Okay guys, this is the day of the project. Um, you can see the contractors have came and they have left because unfortunately I uh, apparently brought the wrong type of trim molding. I brought PVC versus wood and I was wondering why it was so expensive. Um, but we wanted to actually use the same material that we put in our dining room for the trim molding. So he's going now to um, try to exchange all of it and get the wood trim molding. So I'll come back once a little more progress has been made. First box is on the wall. Exciting. Third box is going on the wall now. Making progress. Okay guys, so this is day two. They finished the second wall and also the first wall. They're gonna come back today and caulk, paint, and hang the iron pieces. So I'll be back this afternoon after work to show you the final product. Okay guys, so here is the end of the project. Um, it's been a few days, I've been really busy. So I just had a moment um, to come and show you guys, but it looks really, really nice. It, I think it definitely adds depth and dimension to the foyer now. It's not just these tall, huge, plain gray walls. Um, I'm not finished with the project. I did order um, a customized uh, last name um, wall decal to go over the door in between the door and the window. And then I do want to eventually add some molding around the window and put maybe like a swag um, or a, a swag balance or scarf balance on a um, curtain rod up there. I don't want to cover the window, just maybe do kind of like a scarf balance. And then, like I said, I'm going to put a window decal there. I am going to change out this chandelier. Um, it's like a bronze color, so I want, I think I want the um, black iron and I want the traditional style foyer chandelier with like, you know, nine different lights or something like that. So I've been pricing those. And then down in this corner here, I do want to put 
maybe one of those tall vases and some tall branches or something or maybe on both sides of the door and then stay tuned because I am getting door estimates because I do want decorative glass um, in the door and also on the two side lights so this is what it looks like for now um, this was a fairly inexpensive project I think we spent around um, $700 on, on it and $300 was paying my contractor to actually install it so probably about four to four fifty on materials not bad at all and you can definitely install this yourself um we just didn't because we have a two-story foyer and we didn't have the tall ladders and all that stuff and then this would have been our first time installing trim and up on a tall ladder like that we didn't think was a good idea but i definitely definitely do like it and again we got the exact same panels from the pinterest picture that we found at Hobby Lobby. They were originally $60 each, but they have sales like every week on different items and their iron decor was on sale um, for a couple of weeks actually. So I was able to get them 50% off $30 each. This is how it turned out. And I hope you guys like it. Stay tuned. I am gonna do those other things and I do have more videos coming soon. Thank you.